So this influencer is in big trouble. Now she goes by the name Meatball. And last week she allegedly helped instigate some looting of some businesses in Philadelphia. And how do we know Meatball was involved in this? Because she live streamed the whole thing. She recorded people looting Lululemon. She recorded them looting a liquor store. Everybody must eat. Everybody must eat. And she even recorded them looting an Apple store. Free apples. Free apples. Which is funny because the second they stole those phones, a message appeared on the screens telling them the device is being tracked and authorities have been alerted. So then they had to smash all the phones they just stole. But then Meatball gets a little cocky. Told the police they either lock me up tonight or it's gonna get, it's gonna get lit. Now allegedly the footage she was filming was so insane she had over 10,000 people watching her live. But you want to know who else was watching her live? Philadelphia police. There was a cop watching the live stream. And they go after her. And eventually they catch up to her. Yo, what are y'all doing? We don't got nothing to do with this. Yeah. The then of course, here she is getting arrested. And here's her mug shot. But then she gets out on bail. Almost immediately, she gets on live stream and starts talking again. All that needs to be expunged off my record, bro. Like, what? I am an innocent person, bro. And now her story's everywhere. And so the local news wants to interview her. And her mom, she knows what's up. And she is not having it. Our attempts to speak with her were cut short by her mom. Blackwell's mom did not want her speaking with reporters. Mom, stop beeping the horn. What are you doing? Yeah, I'm guessing mom knows. Maybe it's time for Meatball to stay silent for a while. Now, did Meatball learn anything from all this? Well, she says she regrets it. I regret. But she also made her mugshot into her Instagram profile pic. And she's selling it on t-shirts, so she must not feel that bad.